You know what they say, you can take the Georges out of Greece, but you can't take the Greece out of the Georges. Hello everyone, and welcome to s Monday? Monday. It is Monday. Good lord, it is Monday. Uh, special treat today, because we just went to Greece and experienced all sorts of Greek fun foods and things like that, Mal decided that today we would make a Greek quinoa, which is exciting because we're trying to eat uh, more healthy, and uh, Mao actually planned out all of our lunches and dinners this week um, to be more on the healthy spectrum, and one of those changes that we've decided to make is eating quinoa, and quinoa is good. I know that the first time I had it, I was kind of like, mm, what is this? It was like eating little beads, and it is, but it is good, and um, we are making quinoa, or Mao made quinoa. Where is the quinoa? Fridge. Shelf. It's in the fridge? Is that where it's supposed to be? I thought it was supposed to be warm. No, it's cool. It's a salad. Wait, what? It's a salad. Like legit? Mm-hmm. Like legit. Like you don't eat it warm? No. So it's gonna be cold. It's gonna so it's gonna be bad? No. I didn't know it was served. Is it really served cold? Yes. But why? But it would be fine warm. It would melt the cheese. What's wrong with that? Trust me. Sorry, this is the first I've heard that the quinoa was going to be cold. I don't know how I feel about cold quinoa. Because like, all the past times we've had it, it's been hot and it's been good. Maybe it'll be fine. Maybe I want mine hot. If I want mine hot, I can, de I can heat it. Yes. I guess. Anyway, uh, tomatoes. Uh, Mal cut up some olives, feather. Please ignore the cat food. The cat food's not included in any of these dishes. We just haven't gotten it up into the cabinet because that's the kind of people we are. We are that lazy. Um, actually, no, we're not. We're not lazy. Uh, we have to use up the ones we have first before we use the new ones. Sure. Um, we've actually gotten quite a bit done today. I'm just sitting down to edit to the moon. We recorded the entirety of to the moon, which. Um, it's, it's a short game. It was very good. It was very, very good. If anyone is interested in playing it for themselves, do it. It's, it's not very long. I think it's about four to five hours. And uh, it was a really good experience. It reminded me in some ways of Mother 3, and I said that in the, in the video. Um, but I think it's just because it's pixel art, and it's at times quite sad. It's, it's a sad game. It's very emotional. And... Um, it was really good. I'm really glad we played it. And there's a there's a few other little things that go with it. There's little, like, mini-sodes. And we're going to play those as well. But we recorded the entirety of To the Moon today, so that's done. i got to get that started editing. Um, got tonight, and then Tuesday and Wednesday. And then Thursday, like, evening or afternoon or something, we're going to Charleston. So I've also been helping out Emil with some graphics um, for an upcoming uh, Let's Play of his. There's a lot of graphic work, and I did a ton of stuff on it. A few months ago. Um, I'm really proud of it. In fact, I just saw it again for the first time in a few months and I was like, oh man, I, I did good. There's a, like I've been helping him with, with projects for a while um, for like in game graphics and stuff, but I feel like I'm getting better and his stuff is looking better, so I'm excited about it. Um, but he needed a lot of, of extra stuff from me and he needs it like now. So it sucks because we have to leave in like three days. And he needs this stuff, and I get to get him that stuff, but I already, like, don't have enough time to, like, finish what I'm doing. So, I'm gonna... I, I think I'm actually gonna make Mal do it. Sorry, Mal. But you're probably gonna be... I gonna watch Netflix. Exactly! You're not doing anything. Uh, so I'm probably gonna show her exactly what I need done for him, and she's probably gonna handle it tonight. Um, and that'll take care of it. It's not hard to do, it's just a little time-consuming. it probably take just a few hours to to finish up, but that'll take care of him, and I think he's set for a while until I have to make him a new logo, so that'll be good. Um, otherwise, I'm editing to the moon, and um, God, I got two, maybe two and a half days to get everything done. I don't even know what's going to get done, but eh, we'll see. All right, is the quinoa ready? Just about. All right, let's give cold quinoa a shot. That's a completed product. It is cold. I just wanted to point out the fact that it is cold. I was not aware it was going to be cold. I'm, I'm kind of worried because I tend not to like cold foods. 
So, it's okay. But I feel like it's okay only because it's still kind of lukewarm. Like, I, I don't think I would like this cold. I, I don't think it should be cold. Why is it cold? It should all be melted. Why does it matter? It's okay. Why does it, why does it matter if the cheese is melted? I mean, is that a problem? That's your cheese is melted? That's, those tomatoes are good, though. I mean, this is good. I just feel it's good because it's warm. If it was, like, super chilled, like cold, I don't think it would be good. I think it would be kind of gross. But I also don't like cold foods like that, so. Hmm. Anyway, um, that's it for today. If you're into cold foods, maybe you'd like this, I don't know. It's not bad. You just do. Why you dumped all the olives on there? I don't like them. I mean, I I don't like a thousand. <laughs> I don't want all of your olives. Uh, we continue into work and, and, and things like that. Um, there's a lot of stuff going on. There's, there's so much to accomplish in just a few days' time. Um, tomorrow, I put it off today, but I think tomorrow we'll talk about it water. Um, it was it was something I, I wasn't 100% sure how I was going to handle or if I was going to cover, um, but I think I should cover it, and um, we'll, we'll talk about it tomorrow. One of the reasons I wasn't going to cover it is because I'm behind, and I know it's going to be a while, and I don't like to remind people of those sorts of events, but it was is such a big passing that we, I, I think we, we, we should cover it, so I'm probably going to talk about that tomorrow. So Bring your thoughts for that to the table uh, for the next day. Thanks for watching. And uh, as always, let's be back tomorrow, shall we? Recipe for this will be down below if you want to check it out. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm going to start eating healthy. If things go well for the next month or so, we'll probably turn it into like a, a vlog thing. You guys may recall many years ago we did the soda challenge. We may kind of turn it into that. Did you learn all those lies from your Borgia masters? I speak the truth. It is you who tell the people lies. Me and you. Let's go. Give me the code sheet. All I will give you is death.